Hi guys, literally about to leave the office and someone just said, can you do a quick video on ototoxic drugs for my exam tomorrow? I'm really struggling. So here it is. Ototoxic drugs are drugs that can damage the inner ear and they could potentially do things like hearing loss or tinnitus or vertigo and anything that really the inner ear can impact. So it's very dose dependent, of course, and not all these medications will always cause these things, but it's worth remembering a few key ones. So we start at the top here with loop diuretics, things like frosamide, things like bumetanide, potentially can be ototoxic. Three main types of antibiotics to remember. You've got your aminoglycoside antibiotics, gentamicin, for example, is the classic one that we think of. You have your macrolide antibiotics, things like erythromycin, perhaps. And then you've got your tetracycline antibiotics, things like doxycycline, potentially can be ototoxic. Then you have your anti-malarial medication, things like chloroquine. You have your anti-inflammatories, things like aspirin, and your non-steroidal anti-inflammatory medications. And at the top there, anti-neoplastic drugs, things like cisplatin, classically can lead to ototoxicity. So remember, they all are in a loop. It starts with loop directed to the top. Then it's all about the antis, antibiotics type one, antibiotics type two, antibiotics type three, anti-malarials, anti-inflammatories, and anti-neoplastic medication. Of course, there are a few others as well, but remember these and hopefully it will help in your exams. Hashtag can pass, will pass. Hashtag I went with Aurora.